Hello. This is the voice of Dylan Flynn. Hi, this is the voice of Trevor Ikrath. And you are listening to Wordle with Friends, the show where two friends do the Wordle. It's another Thursday coming down the pipeline. That means one more day till the weekend and one more day that you and I have to do the New York Times Wordle. It's an early one. We haven't done it this early since the early days of this program. No, but to preview an upcoming little mini arc, another one, uh, beginning today, I am going to be joining our good friend and once and probably future guest on this program, Max Stenstrom, on a little bit of a tour across the West Coast with his band, Infinite Freefall. So we might have some rough recording sessions up ahead but i mean we'll manage it as it comes right it's gonna be a blast don't take any drugs or have sex with any rock and roll floozies trevor it's just that just reminds me of my first time going to college right it was my first day of college move-in day and my parents were helping me move in dropping me off at school i'd be living at school out on my own for the first time the last thing my mom says to me before we say goodbye for, you know, weeks, maybe months, teary-eyed, tears in my mother's eyes as she begs me not to try heroin. <laughs> got you busting into your dorm going, who's got heroin? Today is Thursday, November 17th, 2022, and Trevor and I are about to attempt to solve Wardle number 516. So this is your warning to turn back now if you've not yet done today's puzzle, as there will be spoilers ahead. Ah, uh, sweet 516. I'm going first today. I'm going to get this show on the road. What would be a good word to play? I don't know. Something with five letters, none of them repeating, maybe some commons. How about this one? I don't think this has been the solve before. Okay. Wow, I got one green letter for playing the word clone. Clone. I think I'm a clone now. It's an attack of the... Hmm. So it's not Star Wars Day on Wordle.com today. Hmm. Why overthink it? Let's just hang on to that slot 5E, huh? Those things have a history of going there, don't they? Hitting. Enter. Now. What do you know? It was the slot 5E. I got one yellow letter and one green letter. I played the word brave. Brave. Okay. So it's also not... Uh, National Anthem Day. No. On Wordle.com. No. Well, I mean, it could be that A, right? What if I, uh, what if I just, uh, hold on to that A? That good old A. I'm pretty sure this has been the solve before, but I'm just gonna play it, because I wanna, I wanna get a move on. Hey, they can't all be winners, can they? Here we go. Oh, it was not the A. I still only have, uh, one green letter for playing the word gauze. Gauze. Yeah. It was the solve once upon a dream, wasn't it? I thought it was, yeah. Um, I'll figure it out. I'm going to figure this out. Okay. Hey, you know there's no Z in this thing. I did some of the hard work for you. Thanks, bud. Yeah. My my new approach is just solve the puzzle, you know? Yeah. Just finish it. I don't know why we haven't been trying to do that uh, until now. Well, you know, it's these kinds of strategies take time. To develop, yeah. I wouldn't be surprised if there's two E's in this word. I also would not be shocked. Yeah. I see I see a couple of plays that would use an I as the showcase vowel of the solve. But look at these. These words that I found, are these Tracy caliber words? I don't know. We have a standard to live up to now. Yeah. Let's try a double E. Let's try a word with a couple of these E's in it, huh? Okay, yeah, why not? Here we go. Fuck! Okay, well, that did, this didn't go according to plan. No? What'd you get? I got four green letters. Oh, thank God. I played the word where. Where? Yeah. Man, your pronunciation of that was so perfect. I heard that H. Even though some would, some would accuse it of being silent in that word. I heard you pronounce it. You know, in the, wor- in the world of uh, over-the-phone <laughs> word games, one must really elocute to almost an absurd extent so i wonder if it's what this what it obviously could be right i just felt like there's a there's kind of a divine feminine to the tracy bennett arc and where is a word that i associate with a sort of a famous female anti-hero carbon san diego oh sure yeah because you know nobody ever knew where the fuck that broad was yeah. i'm going to play this word that i think it is okay Five green letters. Wow. 
I mean, so then it must, right? It must, of Mm. course. I mean, just don't overthink it, you know? Five green letters. My round two asked the question. The question was where. My round three now answers that question. The answer is there. And there is something that I would love for our listeners to do. You know what it is. That's right. Send us an email at <laughs> wordlefriends at gmail.com. You can find the show on TikTok or Twitter by searching Wordle Friends. You could also find us on YouTube. If you're already watching us on YouTube, why don't you give us a follow? Why don't you ring the bell to Ooh. subscribe to our channel? Oh, yeah. Why don't you leave us a comment? We love those. Hey, tell us what uh, your first word that you played was today or something like that, right? Or, sure. hey, just say hi. Man, I've seldom heard so many pieces of good advice in a row. I'm just kind of soaking them up. But for now and for always, I've been Dylan Flynn. I've been Trevor Aikrath. And we'll see you back here tomorrow on the show where friend is a five-letter word. This has been a production of The Lighthouse Keepers Company. Culture Illuminated.